Hi, this is Dale O'Shills, pastor of Church of the Redeemer in Gaithersburg, Maryland. Thank you for joining me for our devotional time today. We're so glad that you're part of this time of sharing and learning and growing each day, taking some time to reflect upon uh, principles from God's Word. We're talking this week about uh, different things that can happen in our lives that can create a lot of emotional stress for us. We talked about disappointments on our first day, and then yesterday we talked about delays and having to wait on things at times and the frustration that we can experience when we're waiting. I want to talk today about some disabilities in life. You know, in life sometimes we just don't have the ability that we'd like to have to accomplish something. And when we're dealing with a disability, it can be extremely frustrating. There's a man in the Bible in John chapter 5. You can read about this story beginning in the very first verse of John chapter 5. He was a man that Jesus found one day at a place called the Pool of Bethesda in Jerusalem. And he was lying there. He was an invalid. He'd been there for 38 years. Think about that. He'd been 38 years in his disability. He was not able to get into the water, into the pool, because uh, he, it seemed as though every time he tried to get there, someone else would get in his way. He could never make it in. He could never find his place of healing because of a disability in his life. And in that moment, uh, in the midst of all of his pain and frustration and, and a dimension of hopelessness because of his disability, Jesus showed up in his life and Jesus helped him to find the healing that, uh, that, that only he could bring to him. And the beautiful part of this story, at least for me, is so many beautiful parts of the story, but one of the beautiful parts of the story is this. This man experienced a healing after 38 years of illness, after almost four decades of facing a problem in his life, a disability in his life, Jesus came to him and helped him. That means that there's hope for you. It doesn't matter how long you've been in something, how long a disability has been crippling your life in some way, something's been holding you back. Maybe it's been a habit that you've had for a long time. You've thought, well, I'll never get over this. It seems as though this is crippling my life and paralyzing my life and keeping me from being the person that I want to be. Don't you give up because just like Jesus came to that man after his 38th year and found him there at the pool of Bethesda and healed him, Jesus is looking for you. He's coming to help you. He will help you deal with the disabilities in your life.